Hello and welcome to my channel, The Senior Crochet. My name is Priscilla and I would like to thank all my new subscribers for coming to check me out and all my return subscribers for spending some time with me. Alright everyone, so last week I had made a video letting you all know that I'll be participating in the hashtag July Makes 2022, which is hosted by Jeanette of DOI Creations. So I will link that video down below. Um, I will link Jeanette's video down below. And um, I just wanted to come back and show you guys what I'll be trying to finish up. Uh, so the first thing I want to, well, i do this one first. Okay, so the first thing I want to show you is in my little bag, so you probably already know what it is. <laughs> uh, it is the other sock to a sock I was making, and this is the yarn, the fruits yarn. Um, I think the label fell off somewhere. I'm not for sure what color this is. I think it's like plum or something like that. But it's just uh, real pretty purples and pinks. And um, this is my new knit sock pattern that I'm working on. But these are a gift for someone. So I did finish uh, one of the socks. And then I'm working on the second one. So I'm hoping to uh, finish the second sock. So that I can get, um, get it over to them. Where they can enjoy it. <laughs> and that's the first thing that I'm going to be trying to finish up. So that is that project and then it's the fruits um, by Premier Yarns if I didn't say that the sock yarn and the next thing wait a minute that's not it <laughs> the next thing that I'm working on I'm using my um, Hobby Lobby yarn the uh, Urban Chic and this is in the color Denim Days it is let's see it's a number three 78 percent acrylic 22 percent cotton you get 275 yards so that is what i'm using and actually this is also a knit project <laughs> um i'll see if i can pop a picture in of what it looks like i think it's called the mm, what is it called the um front Complete Dolman. I think that's what it's called. And it's from Interweave. No, it's not from Interweave. It's from Knit. Knit. Um, Knitwear uh, 2014, I believe. So I, I probably put all those pictures up already by now. But um, so that is what I'm working on. I didn't have um, just a solid color yarn in the kind of makeup that they wanted they wanted like a cotton linen kind of type yarn i do have some cotton linen from hobby Lobby, but it's too thick so that wouldn't have worked out either and so the the urban chic was the closest yarn that i could find so it does it's a little different <laughs> in how it looks um because of the striping in the yarn but i don't mind it so much to me it looks more like hand crafted then bought from the store so somebody would probably be able to look at it and say or question like did she make that because <laughs> you know you wouldn't see something like this in the store but anyway let me show you guys my progress so that is the top and the reason why it's striping this way is because of the construction of the top so they have you work the top part first going from one side to the other side and it's like but it's enough stitches um, this way where it it meets the back as well okay so yes that part is worked like that and then you bind off and then you rejoin your yarn and you start working the body so that is why it looks like it's two different um patterns but that <laughs> because of the yarn so that's probably why they use the solid yarn um but i don't i don't mind it i'm excited about getting it finished and this in the center is where um, the pleating is supposed to go it'll probably show up more once I stitch it in place let me see yeah and it's on the needles too so it's kind of hard to see but that is my progress so far so pretty much all I have to do is finish the length in the body and then come back and add the um, edging on the neck and at the bottom of the body so uh, I was really hoping to get this done um, very very soon but I'm not this is almost gone. <laughs> I don't think I'll be able to get it done as 
fast as I want it. And I think I'm going to try to finish the socks first before I finish this. But there's it might be a point in time where I work on both. So, not for sure. But anyway, <laughs> those are the main two projects that I'm going to try to um, get finished uh, for the month. Um, also, you know, I am working on my Work Your Whips Monday project. So which is the cardigan gun poncho so if you haven't seen that video yet i'll link it down below where you can check it out and this is my progress on that so far um it's also worked in one piece i'm going over the shoulder like that and then it'll be worked across with shaping to go around the neck and then finish off on the other side so those uh are my main three projects that i'm going to try to finish off for this um hashtag july mix challenge so hopefully i'll be able to get them done i did want to share with you guys where i'm at and my progress on them so uh, when i do finish them you'll know at least i was working on them in this month now all of a sudden it's an fo <laughs> so i just wanted to show you my progress all right so that is pretty much all i had to share with you guys today um please leave me a comment down below if you're joining in in this challenge whether you have a channel or not you can participate um, I believe you just need to post on some kind of social media and um, tag Jeanette in the tag if you wanted to be entered for a prize that she's giving away. Alright, but other than that, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think of my projects. Um, tell me about yours. Remember to give this video a thumbs up and I will see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.